In a survey undertaken for the Daily Star, 64% of Brits said they think alien life has visited Earth already. Over a third of us said that aliens are already present on Earth and almost as many said they believed aliens look just like us. And quite a few scientists think we're right. Britain's first astronaut, Helen Sharman, believes alien visitors could easily be on Earth right now, studying us while remaining undetected. She says, it's possible they're here right now and we simply can't see them. Former Pentagon official Luis Elizondo agrees that the aliens are here already. Speaking to the New York Times, he said UAPs cited by U.S. military personnel were far more advanced than any known human technology. These aircraft, well call them aircraft, he said, are displaying characteristics that are not currently within the U.S. inventory nor in any foreign inventory that we are aware of. He added that the unidentified flying objects reported by U.S. Navy aviators were things that don't have any obvious flight services, any obvious forms of propulsion, and maneuvering in ways that include extreme maneuverability beyond, I would submit, the healthy G-forces of a human or anything biological. Andrew Fracknoy, a professor of astronomy at University of San Francisco's Fromm Institute, says aliens could be so alien that we wouldn't recognize them if we saw them. The intriguing possibility is they are, in fact, here, but we just don't know it, he says. Fracknoy adds that an extraterrestrial civilization that emerged before humanity could already have sent out probes, or even the seeds of life, across the galaxy, in all the mathematical models, a species that started early in the history of the galaxy and had the will and resources to diffuse could by now have filled many parts of the galaxy with its artifacts or biological spores, he said. His theory could have been proven if we had managed to get a probe out to meet mysterious cosmic visitor Oumuamua in 2017. Harvard astronomer Avi Loeb wrote a paper suggesting that Oumuamua's strange shape and unexplained acceleration could mean it was a centuries-old probe sent by an alien civilization. He says that it could have been launched long before humans evolved. Intelligent life is more recent in the Earth's history, but at the same time, given that it happened here, there is the possibility that it exists elsewhere, he said. I don't think we should pretend that we are the only ones, the smartest kid on the block, because very likely we aren't the smartest kid on the block. Sharman adds that even if the aliens haven't made it to Earth already, it's a certainty that they are out there somewhere, there are so many billions of stars out there in the universe that there must be all sorts of different forms of life, she says. Will they be like you and me, made up of carbon and nitrogen? Maybe not.